Alright, I'm going to show you Ed Fenninger denying the fact that the book of James was not written to Christians. In typical non-dispensationalist fashion, he denies that the book of James is written to Jews, not to Christians. Watch this. Notice the tone, notice the arrogance. For a hundred years, dispensationalism taught that the book of James was written to Jewish Christians. It's right back to Schofield Bible. All the early, all the early dispensationalists taught. They read the same thing. I didn't invent this. I didn't invent this. But Ruckman invented the idea that the book of James came as a book of James for tribulational martyrs, for tribulational saints. He invented that idea. That's private interpretation. It's funny how Fenninger says, well, dispensationalists have always believed that the book of James is written to Christians. Uh, what's the standard? Okay, the standard is not what have Christians always believed. The standard is what does the scriptures say. So again, there's this Catholic mentality of, oh, what's the historic position of professing Christians? Again, that's not the standard. The standard is what does the word of God say, not what have Christians always believed. So, typical strawman argument. But here's this next clip of Fenninger saying that the book of Hebrews and the book of James are written to Christians. And I'm going to show you why this is heresy. This is a typical non-dispensationalist heresy. Let's see this clip. Hebrews 11.6 is supposed to be that. Now, and also, they go Hebrews. Hebrews, the book of Hebrews is to Hebrews. These are guys who believe the church began in Acts chapter 2, people. Go to Acts chapter 2 and see the Jews listed from all the, the lands. Jews were the first part of the church. That's the same with James. They go crazy. James did 12 tribes of... You know, 12 tribes. You're not part of the 12 tribes. Well, James is an early book. is right into the first, first part of the Christian. Christianity was Jewish. So according to Ed Fenninger, the book of James and the book of Hebrews are written to Jewish Christians. Really? Let's see about that. James chapter 1, verse number 1. James, a servant of God and of the Lord Jesus Christ to the 12 tribes which are scoured abroad, greeting. Now notice what it doesn't say. It says the 12 tribes which are scoured abroad, Greeting. Notice how it does not say to the twelve tribes which are in Christ. Okay? Every Pauline epistle, with the exception of Hebrews, mentions people who are in Christ. It talks about, you know, to the saints who are in Christ, to them that are in Christ. Okay? Notice how the book of James does not say to the twelve tribes which are in Christ. So the logical conclusion would be if the book of James was to Jewish Christians, he would have written to the twelve tribes which are in Christ scattered abroad. And second of all, when were, when were Christians scattered abroad by God? They weren't. It's the Jews. And they're not in Christ. And in verse 2 when he says, my brethren, he's talking about my brethren according to the flesh, my kinsmen according to the flesh. That's what he's talking about when he says my brethren. So, again, the book of James is written to Jews, not Christians. Because again, it would say the twelve tribes were in Christ, which it does not say that. And same thing with Hebrews. Every Pauline epistle says people talks about people who are in Christ. Notice how the book of Hebrews does not mention anybody who is in Christ. There's no mention of anyone in Christ in the book of Hebrews. And another thing too is if you want proof on nobody being in Christ in the book of James, just go on your Bible app and search up, just type the term in Christ and it'll go from the section of James to Jude and the term in Christ, from the, from the epistles of James to the epistles of Jude, the term in Christ only appears twice, and it's in 1 Peter 3.16 and 1 Peter 5.14. So there's nobody who's in Christ in the book of James. Same thing with Hebrews. There's nobody who's in Christ in the book of Hebrews. So they're not written to Christians. They're written to Jews, and the Jews are not saved. They're not in Christ. They're dispensationally for people in the time of Jacob's trouble. Jews in the time of Jacob's trouble. Again, Hebrews, Jews. That's what the book of Hebrews is written to. So, just more non-dispensational heresies from Edward Fenninger. Don't be deceived by this heretic. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.